Well, I sleep with my eyes open and they, um, they dry out. And then when I blink, um, my eyelids tear pieces of my eye off. Very painful. And um, I've tried a number of things to, to try to keep this from happening. I wrapped an ace bandage around my eyes one night to try to keep them shut, but that didn't work. And uh, tried loading my eyes up with all kinds of goop to keep them wet during the night, but that didn't work. So what I've been doing is taping them shut at night, which seems to work okay, but it, uh, it's pretty uncomfortable. It looks pretty funny too. One morning I woke up with this little like piece of flesh growing off the end of my nose, like a little flesh stalactite. And, 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 and it was growing, it kept growing, and my friends kept looking at me and saying, you got some snot on your nose? And I'd say, it's not snot. It's not. So I call up. Now, when you call a Christian science practitioner, you're not supposed to mention any disease names. You know, it gives it power. Don't name the condition. Just refer to it as an error. So needless to say, there's a lot of innuendo that goes around that word error. Uh, an Indian sweat ceremony could be interesting, uh, especially if you're going to be around uh, female Indians sweating. Teresius is androgynous. You don't know if it's a man or a woman. It's, hello. You what? You want to see who? Dr. X is very busy. You just have to take your chances and come on out and come early because you're going to have to fill out an extensive dietary questionnaire. And he begins with burrito. All right? How many burritos have you had in the past six months? Um, no, I got a photographic memory. And I can remember the Mexican restaurants, but I can't remember what was on the plate. Was it a burrito? Was it a taco? All right, please. How many? Quickly, quickly. Um, 18. All right, 18 burritos with a whole wheat of flour. Whole wheat? I mean, I don't travel in those circles. All right, 18 flour. Um, on to borscht, please, borscht. Uh, pictures of Trini Boca doing psychic surgery on the walls. We get to the end of the car. There's this huge crucifix of Jesus. Who else? And I turn. And we went out and sat on a park bench in Central Park, and I looked across the park, and in the distance I saw leaves blowing in the wind, a bunch of children running, a red ball rolling, a flock of starlings taking off. I covered my right eye, no leaves, blur of children, blotch of red, no birds. Covered my left, ah, ecstasy. Covered my right, despair. Ecstasy, despair. And I realized at that moment that I was now living the perfect yin and yang existence. And Renee and I went home, and I ate big fish, and I drank a bottle of wine, and I smoked a cigar. And I ate, and I drank, and I smoked everything that could make me blind.